Hello everyone, this is Jonathan Rademacher. I also go by JR at Proficient. I am the principal for the Salesforce practice. I've been in the Salesforce space since 2008. I've been with Proficient for five years, but before that I was part of an acquisition of a company called Sundog where I was there for 15 years. So on the Proficient books, I've been with Proficient for 20 years. So Dreamforce, I've been been to a couple of them. Uh, this is number 15 for me, so all the musical acts are always fun. You know, really all the relationships that, that I've made over the years. Um, there's so much virtual going on right now where you're seeing people on Teams or on Zoom, etc. Be like to actually be in front of them, you know, get a cup of coffee, have a conversation. Clients you've worked with in a very corporate setting, getting them away, whether taking them golfing or you know, just going for a walk in the park or grabbing lunch is really a big part of the conference and the experience. Trick question because gathering knowledge at Dreamforce is really tough. Dreamforce goes by in a blink of an eye and between walking from place to place and, and learning uh, via the fire hose, you don't take a lot in. So my recommendation is one, comfortable shoes, two, bring a water bottle, and over the years, I've had notepads, I've had things like that, but the last couple of years, I've switched to using the Notes app on my phone and the microphone. And the reason being, um, I can't type or write as fast as the content's coming in. So being able to, to dictate as I'm walking out of a session, um, you know, was, as I'm walking across the ideas I have, and then makes them actionable, right? Making sure you're going through your notes, making sure you're analyzing them, so you actually have the follow-up items. So when you get back in the office, you can reach out to that person, you can go and watch that video again, uh, you can uh, relive that connection that you had at Dreamforce. So the product I want to learn more about in the last two years have been feverishly learning uh, about the uh, Einstein platform, right? Which is the generative AI. It's, it's all the AI you've learned about, um, whether it's probabilistic or deterministic. That's a big part of it, right? Another big part is data cloud. So data cloud has been around for over a year. We just received our expert level designation for data cloud. And I'm looking to connect more on where that's going. We've got a lot of large clients that are doing very complex data cloud implementations. And at Dreamforce, we're able to have um, executive briefings, check in with the people that actually built data cloud that work on it every single day. So those are the two areas I'm most excited about. And then also the industry clouds, right? Big focus on industry, but that foundation of data and AI are, are where everything's going and the most interesting to me right now. So lots of great stuff. Again, lots of links, uh, whether they're the notes of a, of a presentation, whether it's part of a, um, a group we have, whether it's an EBC, things like that. Whether we can bring back that knowledge is a big part of it. Also some cool stuff, right? Trinkets, things are given out, little uh, tchotchkes, things like that. It's fun to bring them back. If team members weren't able to make it to the conference, they can have that part, whether it's a sticker on their laptop or a plush or, or a t-shirt. You know, bringing that back along with a story, along with a journey that you are on that you can help share with your team.